17 black caddies have graduated from South Africa's first accredited professional golfing leadership program. The two-year pilots project will train 60 caddies in the Western Cape, the Gauteng, as well as Guazulu Natal. Teeing off to what promises to be a thrilling career, these caddies excel both academically and on the golf course. The program offers hope to underprivileged golfing enthusiasts. It's underappreciated in South Africa and the caddy background is basically generally 90% of the caddies come from a disadvantaged background and they do, the education levels aren't very high. The opportunities for promotion are very limited and to grow in the business. CatSita, along with ETA and fan courts, saw this as an opportunity to develop them, to get guys to a higher level, to get a professional qualification so they can expand their horizons in the golfing industry. 2,000 hours on the golf course and Caddy's international PGA accreditation. This opens doors to a wide range of careers in the industry. It means a lot to me because when I started, I started as a caddy, but then I go to the program of CatSita and after that I do some little of a little jobs like in academy and I'm now employed in one of the best courses that like the Lynx, the Lynx is number one golf course in South Africa. So I'm being employed by the by fan court at the Lynx, which is a great opportunity for me to be in, the, in this in the industry. Women caddies aren't taking a back seat. 2007, I started here to be a caddy, and then I tried to be a caddy. Now, <coughs> my caddy master Prajo suggested that I must be part of this program. So that I came this program, it was very challenging, but I try, and then we have a great opportunity to play different courses in Southern Cape, Simola, Pezula, even there in Plating Pepe. So it was great opportunity for me. It's hoped the program will swell the professional ranks. Segui Chetty, SABC News, George.